Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Silent Core, and today I'm going to be sharing some potentially leaked information on Red Dead Redemption, including possibly a map for the game. So I first came about this map on Reddit a few days ago when it was first leaked and I wasn't sure if I wanted to cover it. I'm pretty skeptical of this, so definitely take everything I mentioned in this video with a pinch of salt. Remember guys, Rockstar have not officially announced any sort of Red Dead Redemption 2 or Red Dead 3 at this stage. However, as per my previous rumour videos, we have gone over some quite convincing evidence suggesting towards its um, existence, such as the 2017 release date, information to be revealed at E3 this year in June, and also Red Dead Redemption 2 Legends of the West being a, an apparent title of the next game. So let's take a look at where this all started. It all started in NeoGAF, where a user known as Midian um, posted this image of the map. He said he got this from a source that he will not mention, and it might be a map for the new Red Dead game. And what's crazy is today, two days later, so many news articles have picked up and posted on this today. You know, we've got GameSpot, TechRadar, and countless other sites picking up on this. So I thought it would be worth taking a closer look with you guys. When TechRadar reported on this, they added that one of their sources close to the development of the Red Dead game has now confirmed to us that the map indeed is the real deal, revealing that this is a very recent art direction for the new upcoming title. If you guys take a look at this map for one second, it does look like it has a really weird art style. The colours just look really weird and I was sort of led to believe that this is sort of like an internal development map. You know, you can see the grids. It just looks like some sort of internal map that, um, you know, it wouldn't be what you'd actually see in the real game. But hey, let's take a closer look. First of all, I want to take you guys to this green area here that kind of stands out on the map. Now this area is called New Bordeaux, I think that's how you pronounce it. This is actually an area where the upcoming game Mafia 3 is based and New Bordeaux is a fictional area that was made up um, to be based on the New Orleans. Now I was pretty surprised to see it referenced here, however, Mafia 3 is being published by 2K Games, who shares the same publisher as Rockstar Games, so it wouldn't be too far out of the question for a Mafia 3 title to be referenced in a Red Dead title. Next up, I wanted to bring you guys' attention to the names of the places at the bottom left of the map. Here you can see the areas known as the Great Plains and Tall Trees areas, and if you look at some of the specific um, names that are labelled, you can see Cockney and also Beecher's Hope, and even the city Blackwater. If you guys remember back to Red Dead Redemption 1, check this out, all those places existed at the top of the map. Now what's even crazier is if you piece both of these map pieces together, they kind of link up. I don't know if you guys can see that, but the land masses almost look like they perfectly match each other. Like this leaked map is could be a continuation of the original Red Dead Redemption's map. So if this was real, maybe the game actually starts out in the old map, and then you sort of work your way north um, throughout the game, and you know there's a storyline continued across them both. Tech Raider quite heavily reported on this map being actually a prequel um, as it doesn't have the real roads in the Great Plains like the original Red Dead Redemption um, did. So, you know, this could be before that was built, a prequel of the game. And they also added that the map shows caravan camps scattered all around, again suggesting that, you know, it's a less occupied um, western area and the overarching theme of Red Dead Redemption was the death of the west. So maybe a prequel of the game rather than a sequel could make more sense. I also want to feature a few finds from a Reddit user known as Big Pappy Knows. He did some pretty close investigating, and he looked really closely at the Blackwater area and compared it to the Blackwater area in the first Red Dead Redemption. And the roads are slightly different. Again, this map could be unfinished, but there's also, you know, another piece of evidence hinting towards this being a prequel. You know, maybe these roads aren't properly built yet in the setting of this prequel. Also, it's worth noting that the apparent leaked map does have islands. Um, in it, so we weren't actually able to swim in the original Red Dead Redemption, so that kind of makes me wonder if we will be able to swim in the next installment of the game. Kind of a shot in the dark, but I guess it was worth mentioning. So that's pretty much all the information I've managed to gather for you guys so far. Um, just to conclude, could this map be fake? Absolutely. In fact, the original leaker of this image even removed it himself from his post and admitted it was fake later on in the thread. However, when you really break things down and look at the absolute detail that is on this leaked map, you know, this could be entirely possible. So let me know what you guys think about this map down in the comments. Let me know if you think it is real or fake. I'm interested to see what you guys think. If you are enjoying these videos and are looking forward to a future Red Dead game, don't forget to leave the video a like. It really helps me out. And subscribe for more videos like this one. And I'll see you guys in the next video.